Some of you right now probably saw that title and thought, I wonder what this is about, and are waiting to find out what I mean by that. Some of you probably like JoJo's Bizarre Adventure, sad to see someone who doesn't like it, and want to know why. Some of you might think that this whole video is going to be some ignorant rant where I say some shit that makes it seem like JoJo's Bizarre Adventure is a bad series. Some of you probably just saw the title of this and disliked it for that reason alone, or probably right now thinking about telling me something along the lines of I'm some inbred abortion who doesn't get the masterpiece that is JoJo's Bizarre Adventure, then proceed to track down my social media and send me death threats. Guess who this video is about? Did you just make a JoJo's reference? This is no time for a JoJo's reference! There's always time for a JoJo's reference! <laughs> Alright, okay! I was making a JoJo's reference! <laughs> <laughs> oh no! Oh my god! <laughs> what the fuck is going on? I don't like JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. I don't think it's bad. I watched part one some time ago. I like the characters. I like the concept. I like the music. I like the story, and I like the animation. So why can't I bring myself to like it? Because of the fans. To be specific, the overzealous fans. The ones who got interested in the series and treat it like it's a series created by the gods themselves. The ones who will scream references and loudly claim that their series is the best and anybody who says otherwise needs to have their minds changed. Look, you can enjoy something. I have no problem with that. You can ignore or hate something. That's fine as well. You can have discussions over something you enjoy. That's fine too. You can make jokes about something you enjoy as well. I don't mind it. But what I do mind is when certain people decide to non-stop scream into my ears, jokes, references, and essentially force me to like something they like because it's something they believe is for everyone. And right now, there are probably some of you thinking, why don't you just not interact with the fans? Why do you let them influence your enjoyment over a show or a film? To which I respond, because I never had a say in the matter. Let me tell you what listening to all this from my noxious JoJo fans throughout the years has been like for me. Do you all remember Let It Go? What about What Does the Fox Say? What about Nyan Cat? What about Gangnam Style? What about the Harlem Shake? What about Fidget Spinners? For what they were, they were ultimately harmless. They were fun ideas and enjoyable for what they were. And then sometime later, after the ideas had caught the attention of so many people, a number of them decided to shove it in everyone else's faces, making it overplayed. And eventually, people just weren't into it anymore and stopped paying attention to it. That's what it's like for me. I've had to listen to JoJo fans throughout my years scream references at me non-stop. And now every time I try to watch it, I can't get it out of my head anymore. Every time, there's just references and people saying JoJo's Bizarre Adventure is the greatest series playing in my head and I'm fucking sick of it all! If you want people to enjoy something you like, you can't just yell at them to like it. When your computer is on the fritz, you don't just scream and hit it until it works again. If you like something, and you want other people to get interested in it, good. Maybe try talking about why you like it in a civil manner. Try pitching the show to those trying to get interested in it with the idea that they know nothing, because most likely, they don't. I like a lot of things. I like Scott Pilgrim. I like Maximum Ride. I like Persona. I like Pokemon. I like Recreators. I like My Hero. I like Avatar. I like Steven Universe. I like Invader Zim. I like Arknights. I like Genshin Impact. But a big reason why I got into a lot of what I like is because the people around me that introduced me to it were able to tell me what they were about. Or they showed me footage of it and I found it to be interesting and I wanted to check it out for myself. The farthest my investment in a series goes for the most part is maybe finding a nice shirt and or hoodie to wear, or buying the physical copy of the media I enjoy, or following the creators on social media to maybe get a heads up on any other plans of mine for the future, or look at artwork done by talented artists. If you don't like what I like, that's perfectly fine. You don't have to. If you want to have a discussion on a show, film, or a game's pros and cons, that's fine too. If you want to share some jokes related to what I like, that's fine too. But if I were to come across someone who's never heard of and is somewhat interested in something I enjoy, the one thing I won't do is scream random shit that sounds like nonsensical malarkey to them and pressure them into liking it as well. You can like JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. You can enjoy it. You can make jokes and references about it with your friends. You can talk about what you like and what you don't like out of it. If that's what you want and that's what you enjoy, more power to you. No problem there. But don't be a bunch of fucking cultists who can't seem to get off Dio Brando's 16-foot vampire dick.